Well, let's switch gears and talk about education matters. An education ministry has pledged to disburse capitation balance to public secondary schools by Friday to avert looming financial crisis that threatens to paralyze operations in learning institutions. Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoa at the same time called on parents to step in and support schools by paying school fees to enable head teachers to run the schools. The 2022 term two school calendar commences countrywide on Tuesday. As the term two of this year officially begins on Tuesday, over 10,000 secondary schools in the country face operational challenges occasioned by changes in funding model by the Ministry of Education and the high cost of basic food commodities. Even as members of Kenya Secondary Schools Head Association petitioned the government over the looming crisis, Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha says all is under control. The difficulties we are having at our homes in Kenya today are not specific for our country. They are everywhere. And so let the politicians not take this and take it to heaven. Hello. Magoha adding that the government will remit the remaining capitation balance for the financial year 2021-2022 by end of this week. In fact, I want to reassure the country today that this government that I'm serving is ensuring that even though we have started a new year, at capitation will be in school by Friday this week. Now that capitation money is, is not toys, it is money which has the value. So if you are a manager in a school, manage it. The CS says that despite the country's bad state of the economy, parents should endeavor to pay school fees to support head teachers run the learning institutions. If you can afford to pay, make sure that you pay for them, if you love them. If you can't afford to pay all, go to school with whichever amount you have that is ready. For the extremely poor ones that get back to school, let me not hear, as Magoa, son of Magoa, that you have sent a Kenyan child from a Kenyan school to go back to nothing. That one will not be acceptable. According to Magoha, the ministry will, in the next two weeks, commission about 16,000 CBC classrooms and register about 100 private schools, which have already converted their primary schools to junior high schools by end of next week. Safi Godanamamo, Citizen TV.